Hello, welcome to Persona 2 Innocent Sin on the PlayStation TV slash Vita. Um, it's been about just over a month since I played last. And like I've mentioned throughout all the ongoing series at the time, uh, it's partly been because my life has been throwing a little bit of chaos and it's changed a lot. But... Because of that, I was unable to do any grinding, because I was going to say I was going to grind and level up Nekomata here, but that uh, didn't happen. It's fine, it's whatever. And also, in between the recording sessions, uh, Sega and Atlas has announced that Personas 3, 4, and 5 are coming to Xbox and PC and Switch, which that's pretty awesome, and they're coming to Game Pass too, so that's even better. I am for sure going to play through Persona 5 for, would it be the sixth time? Played Vanilla twice. I played Royal, th yeah, six times. Xbox would be time number six. In fact, due to how slow it get, takes me to get through these games, and the fact that Persona 5 is going to be the first one released on the, all platforms in October, um, shit. The Let's Play of Persona 5 is for sure going to be on the Xbox, and it's going to be, like, playthrough number 7. No, probably 8, because I might play through Royal twice again on Xbox to get all the achievements and, you know, take advantage of New Game Plus. That's the kind of games they are. I don't think, don't think Persona 3 will be out by the time we get to it in terms of Let's Play, because there's about halfway done with this game and it's still got internal punishment and I assume Persona 4 is going to release before they release Persona 3 Persona 4 might be on the Xbox we'll see even though I own it on PC I very much plan to play it on the PlayStation TV here just because I don't feel like I finished it and it's way easier to record off the console than it is PC But anyway, story-wise, we gotta go in... His name is literally Bro. You know, he kinda looks like Tanaka. Hey, how's it going? Check me out. Am I cool or what? Anyway, welcome to Bikini Line. What course did you have in mind today? Talk to Bro. Heal me. We gotta resupply. We got boss fights ahead. We're gonna go fight the leader of the... The leader of the mass circle, King Leo. Oh yeah, what should we talk about? Make small talk. Huh? The attacks? Well, it's the mass circle doing it, right? Then my place should be fine. I'm Joker's best friend. He wouldn't go after a pal like me, unless he decides to pull a prank and crank the heat way up. Sure, come again, and hey, don't forget to bring that cutie with you too. Ha! Huh. Which one? That shopkeeper's talking out his ass about knowing Joker. But it's weird how calm he is. Isn't he scared of the terrorist? I understand what you guys are saying, but it's better than him panicking like everyone else, right? We'll just have to stop the bombings. <laughs> Hear that, Tetsuya? Bro here knows Joker. Guess he doesn't have to worry about his place going up in smoke. Don't you think it's ironic that the concert hall went up in flames after the song about granting ideals? That's where dreams get you. That storekeeper's probably telling himself he'll be fine. People generally don't panic unless they're driven into a corner. Alright, we need to buy healing items. Sister number four. That's you. And then for you, 22, 30. There we go. What were the other items going here? 
Ooh, beads. We have ten beads. Probably could use some reviving. Expensive. Where's this one? Uh, we don't need to do a sweepstakes magazine. There's a lot of optional content in this game that I do not do. Yeah, well, it's miles well, right? Yeah, I think that should do is talk to some people. Come on, crying doesn't help anything. Tell them for me. Cry, baby. There are bombs everywhere. Is God taking not just my girlfriend, but my city too? This is too cruel. The, this latest card wasn't a riddle. Maybe he's not treating this as a game anymore. He's serious now. Better get serious too. I wonder if Maya-san would be okay. Well, that's why we're here for her. We're all in this together. I'm sure she'll be fine. Man, hearing Ginko say that, I bet it's gonna rain. It's gonna rain stars tomorrow. King Leo, Leo will never leave us alone. I know by the burns on my hand, we're his real targets. Yeah, I'm still scared. I feel like I'm compl I'll completely freeze up if I see those flames again. <laughs> Pathetic, aren't I? Surprised she doesn't panic after seeing Tetsuya fight, because he's fire. Volcanus and eventually Apollo drop some heavy flames everywhere. Alrighty. I'm gonna go to Kunan. And he is at the Aerospace Museum. Looks like a pack of kids here. The arrows. Alright, there's kids there. We gotta rescue kids. Wait, what you talking about? I wonder what that police detective's name is. Those glasses really suit him. Such a sharp look. Talking about uh, my brother here? Yep. Honestly, nothing's changed. Society starts breaking down and we have to deal with the stupid hoaxes. Last battalion, my foot. It's obvious the group of five terrorists witnessed at the scene is behind it all. Don't get taken in by silly rumors, okay? I've uh, seen a lot more of you in next game. There we go. Uh-oh. Looks like some kids are here on the field trip. What should we do, Maya-san? We need to evacuate the children before we can start looking for the transmitter. Let's tell the teacher and get his, get her cooperation. <laughs> Heaven calls. Earth calls. The people call. Uh, what's my next line? Defeat evil, wasn't it? That's right. The world calls for me to defeat evil. Tadashi, Tamaki, what are you two doing up there? Eh, jeez, Yukino, we're wearing these masks for a reason. Don't blurt our names out like that. Developer self inserting himself. Evildoers who threaten to choke our peaceful tomorrow with the shadow of fear. I'll send you to hell where you belong. Let's do this, partner. Ha. Huh. Oh, are you okay? You can deceive society, but you don't fool me. We we already know that you're the Fuhrer's minions. Sorry about all this. Tadashi swallowed the stuff that his teacher named Okumura told us at the agency. Ah, geez, Tamaki. That's detective client confidentiality. You can't just go around telling anyone who we're working for. Look, there's no way Yukino and her friends are the Fuhrer... Fewer's minions. Cool your thick head and think for a second, idiot. King Leo's voice. I've been waiting for you, cursed star. Allow me to ignite a welcoming, well, well, fuck me, welcoming flame as congratulations for making it here.
No. Each floor of this aerospace museum has a trap that will ignite after a certain amount of time, starting with the lowest floor. Which you will not escape me, er. Oh, okay, I was gonna say, that's the wrong witch, but he's calling her a witch. Witch? You will not escape me this time. Everything is destined to perish regardless. You and these brats will be in early sacrifice. Evil laughter. Mm. I won't run anymore. I won't give in. Listen everyone, we need to get all the children to the roof. I remember this place being made up of four pretty big floors. You two, find the teacher and head to the rooftop. Too bad, um... Tamaki can't summon demons anymore. She doesn't have her little device that they could use it to use. Our job will be ch to check each floor's exhibition rooms and make sure there are no kids who haven't evacuated yet. Let's get this done, guys. We need to search everywhere for them. Oh boy, this fun part. I also have to deal with enemy encounters too. Okay, that's locked. Which is annoying that they did that. Can't go through here. Right to left. There's not a door. Now it seems like they lowered the enemy encounter right here, which is nice. Elevator. You don't want to be in an elevator in the middle of a fire. Can't get through here. Is this really the only way I, place I can go? That's blocked off. You can't get through here. This is blocked off. Map me. Oop. Yeah, that's like that's legit. All I can go upstairs. So I've been playing Tokyo Mirage Sessions, which is another Atlas game. It's basically Shin Megami Tensei meets uh, Fire Emblem. So technically it'll be my first Fire Emblem game. But uh, how that game handles enemy encounters is exactly how Persona 1 and 2 Remake should handle enemy encounters. It's like a combination of this old school random encounter rates with the modern Persona encounter rates. Where the enemies still pop up out of nowhere, but you still have the time to ambush them or attack them. Looks like there's no one in here. Alright, let's move on to the next room. I Maybe they removed enemy encounter rates in this version. I might be thinking of Eternal Punishment. Eternal Punishment, you repeat a lot of the same stuff. Dexterity card, thank you. Oh, wait, there's a room here. No kids in here. Looks like there's no one here. Alright, move on to the next room. Kids, let's move on. Got the right side all searched. Yeah, thankfully the stairs stay blocked. Keep hitting that to go fast. I think there'd be more room down there than probably is. So let's go search. Oh, 
part of. Aha, see, there was a second room. The camera turn turning when you leave messed with me. Also, no kids. So far, so good. Bum, 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 bum. Like that, they turned me around. Ah, we found some kids. Are you all okay? Good, make sure you stay low and cover your mouths before grabbing your asses and running to the roof. Also, stay low. Oh, there is a time limit. I just realized that. Alright, I think that might be this floor. Ow. Oh, fire bad. You think that our we would be immune? Two of us would be immune to that. Tatsuya and Yuki. Apparently our personas don't provide us 24 hour protection. Ah, it's so hot, I'm gonna die. It's her again. No, help me. Is that, is that the cosplayer chick from the bathroom? What's she doing in the zero? She's gonna die if she stays in there much longer. We have what what do we do, Tetsuya? I'll jump down and rescue her. Are you out of your mind, Maya son? It's impossible. The fire's too strong. You don't know a thing. No, you don't know a thing is impossible until you've tried it. Tetsuya kun, I need you to go look for a rope. Once I jump down there, the rest of you will help pull the girl up. Leave this to Maya. This unlocks her prime persona, I believe. Leave this to Maya. We'll go find a rope. Rope. You look after Maya san Tetsuya. She has to face her fear of fire. Hey lady, please help me. We found a rope, Maya san. Are you okay? Alright, pull. Awesome. Your turn, Maya son. Tatsuya-kun! Tatsuya-kun! Tatsuya-kun, can you hear me? Please answer me, Tatsuya-kun! <laughs> Tatsuya-kun, run! You have to run! That is why there was no Persona summoning at the beginning, or awakening at the beginning of the game. Thank you, Tatsuya-kun. You saved me again. How about you? Are you hurt anywhere? Oh my gosh. That was terrible. I'm so scared. It's okay. You're safe now. You did a great job hanging in there. Come on. We shouldn't stay here. You need to hurry up and get to the rooftop too. Excellent stopping point. Can I save? No, because of the timer. It's not, it's not counting down still. So. Okay, good. Volcanus coming in to the rescue. Man, I enjoy how Persona... Uh, yeah, Persona 1 and 2 did do it more than 3, 4, 5. With their Personas doing more. I know I mentioned that before. 
other personas would talk to them too. Anyway, we'll continue on rescuing the children in the next part. Thanks for watching.